Hi everyone, today I got a very powerful product from Realtek. This board is a powerful replacement for ESP32 camera module. The name of this board is AMB82 Mini, which is basically an IoT AI camera Arduino development board. This board is designed for artificial intelligence, machine learning and neural network applications. Also, the board has ultra low power consumption, which basically means there is no need to worry about power consumption. This board has an HDR camera with a resolution of 1080p. When this board is compared to ESP32 cam, it is way ahead. ESP32 has a CPU that operates at 240 MHz, whereas this AMB A2 mini board has a CPU speed of 500 MHz. ESP32 only supports 2.4 GHz Wi-Fi band, but this board can support 5 GHz Wi-Fi. Apart from Wi-Fi, it has a BLE chip that supports Bluetooth Low Energy 5.1. It also supports MCM embedded DDR2 DDR3 memory up to 128 MB. Such a powerful chip, right? In this tutorial, we will learn about the board design pin description, features and capabilities of this board. Then we will set up the Arduino IDE and learn how to program it using the Arduino IDE. We will also undertake some practical exercises with this board like making an LED blink, video streaming over a web server, object detection and identification and 1080p video recording. So let's get started and learn more about this board in detail. Welcome back again. First, let's take a look at this board. The Realtek AMB82 Mini IoT AI camera board is a development tool which is designed to streamline the creation of AI network camera applications. This board has highly integrated Realtek RTL8735 BDM SoC, which features WLAN and BLE solutions. The microcontroller has ARM VATM 32-bit architecture running at a super fast speed of 500 MHz. The board is designed for AI, ML and neural network applications which is done by NPU Intelligent Engine 8 0.4 TOPS. It has 768 KB ROM, 512 KB RAM and 16 MB flash memory. It also supports MCM embedded DDR2 DDR3 L memory up to 128 MB. It supports dual band Wi-Fi network of 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz. The BLE chip embedded in it is Bluetooth Low Energy 5.1. The board has intelligent security support such as hardware cryptographic engine, secure boot, trust zone, etc. As you can see, a microphone is here which supports and audio codec like ADC, DSC and I2S. It can render STR, 3D NR, WDR video at 1080p and 720p resolution with 30 frames per second. It has a powerful camera module called JAXAPT37 which is 1920 x 1080 full HD CMOS image sensor with wide view angle FOV 130 degree optical lens. With a 1920 x 1080 pixel resolution, the camera provides crystal clear image with fine details, making it ideal for a variety of applications including security, photography and videography. To use this camera, first you need to connect the camera to the FVC terminal of this board. Just pull this connector then slightly insert the camera module. Then push the connector again so that camera will perfectly fit. The board needs an antenna for Wi-Fi network. Here is the UFL connector for the antenna. Connect the antenna here. On front side, you can see the SD card slot here. You can insert an SD card here which can store images and videos. There are two push buttons in this board. One is the boot button and other is reset. There are three LED here. The red LED is power LED. Two other are LED B and LED G. 
There are two USB ports as well. They are micro USB and USB OTG. Using the micro USB, we can upload the code to the board or establish a serial communication with the computer. On the both sides of the board, there are GPIO pins, which also supports I2C, UART, SPI, PWM, ADC. Through these interfaces, AMB82 Mini can connect with external electronic components and sensors. One more thing. I have made a difference table about the AMB82 mini board with ESP32 cam. You can follow our website article to learn in detail. There are documentation about this module from official manufacturer. All the important links are shared in website article. In case you want to purchase this board, you can visit Seed Studio and place an order. The board will cost you around $25 only. Okay, that is enough about the board. Now let's move to the programming part. The best part of Realtek AMB A2 mini board is it supports Arduino IDE. You can check the Arduino IDE SDK for this board from the GitHub repository. Open your Arduino IDE. Go to file then preference and paste the following link in the additional boards manager URLs field. Go to board manager icon and type Ameba. So here you can see the board. Just install it. It might take some minutes for installation. Finally we are done now. Now let's upload a blink case and check the working of this board. Open the blink case from the examples menu. Connect the AMB82 mini board to your computer using the micro USB cable. From this board selection option, select the AMB82 mini board and the COM port. The board doesn't have an automatic programmer, so in order to program the board, follow the following sequence. Press and hold the boot button. Then press and release the reset button. Finally, release the boot button. The board has now entered in programming mode. Now, you just need to click on the upload button to upload the code. After uploading the code, the Arduino IDE will show following messages. Now, press the reset button on AMB82 mini board to run it in normal mode. The LED will blink for every 1 second. This completes the testing part. Now, we can start using the board for artificial intelligence, machine learning, neural network applications. Now, let us test the camera and stream the video using web server. This example uses the camera to capture a JPEG image repeatedly and sends the images to a browser continuously using HTTP, creating the effect of a video. Go to Files, Examples, Ameba Multimedia, Captured JPEG, HTTP Display JPEG continues. Open this case. From this line, change the Wi-Fi SSID and password and replace with that of yours. Put the device in programming mode again using the boot and reset button. Now upload the code. After the code is uploaded successfully, open your serial monitor and press the reset button. And look for the messages in serial monitor. The Realtek AMB82 mini IoT board will connect to the Wi-Fi network and print the IP address of the board. Copy the IP address and paste it on your web browser address bar and hit enter. The video stream window will appear here now. Now, you can move the camera in any direction to check the video streaming in web server. You will observe fast moving video streaming without a lag on your web browser. Also look at the video quality, very clear and impressive, right? If you are facing lag in the video or if you have slow internet connection, increase the delay in this following piece of code in loop section. You may increase the delay to 5, 10, 15, 20 milliseconds to observe the changes. Now let's use this camera module for object detection and identification. 
The Realtek AMBA2 Mini IoT AI Camera Board uses the algorithm like YOLO V3, V4, V7. To test this, open the object detection example code from Amoeba NN, object detection loop code. This code has two parts. From this line, change the Wi-Fi SSID and password. In this header file, there are total of 80 objects which are trained for this model. Now, compile the code. After compilation, you can upload the code to the AMB aided mini board. Once code get uploaded, the Arduino IDE will show the following messages. Press the reset button and wait for the AMB A2 mini board to connect to the Wi-Fi network. The serial monitor will show the board's IP address and network port number for RTSP. The result of detected object can be validated using VLC. You may download VLC media player and install on your computer. Now go to media and open network stream. Copy the IP address with the syntax. The default RTSP port number is 554. Now click on play. Open successful object detection or rectangular frame known as a bounding box will appear around the identified objects with a confidence score, reflecting the system's ordinary in its identification. Here are some samples of images and objects recognized inside the room. Here are some samples of images and objects recognized outdoor. The device is only able to identify the objects that are trained. They are 80 objects. To deactivate the detection of certain objects, set the filter value to 0. For example, set the filter value to 0 to exclude the detection of car. Then upload the code again. Now you can see no car is being detected. For video recording example, insert the SD card in the SD card slot. From the example menu, open one of the record MP4 examples in File, Examples, Amoeba Multimedia, Record MP4. From this line, change the time as for how long you want to record the video. Now, compile the code. After compilation, you can upload the code to the AMB A2 mini board. After pressing the reset button, the Amoeba Pro 2 board will start recording MP4 to SD card. After the recording duration has passed, the MP4 file will stop recording. You can now remove the SD card and check the recorded video on your computer. Look at the video quality. Very, very impressive, right? Alright, that's all from the video part today. We will come up with more video about this product soon. Hope you liked this video. Thank you so much for watching.